Fear grips you once you test positive for a disease that is claiming the lives of hundreds of people daily. Globally, over 100 million cases have been recorded. Over 2.4 million have died, whereas over 84 million have recovered. Dealing with COVID-19 appears to be a daunting task, as persons who have fought and survived the virus consistently say so. COVID-19, according to survivors, has been the worst health complication they have suffered. Unfortunately, some persons continue to doubt the existence of the virus and therefore refuse to observe the safety protocols. To influence such perceptions and provide real COVID-19 experiences, some persons upon testing positive have taken to social media to chronicle their journey whilst cautioning the public through their struggle with the virus. In September 2020, a former health minister of education, Dr. Matthew Upoku Prempe, shared his harrowing experience of contracting COVID-19 with broadcast journalist Kwame Sefakain. Uh, then is here. I mean, that I mean, I see you. Yeah. I mean, I see you can be called man. Who be there? I'm to hear me a cat. The pia, I hear no father. I hear so young. No, the pia the quarter I see. If you call a car, you know, mama. The man here, me here, here, I just say, and cry, and cry. You push your little young fango. In February this year, the Metropolitan Archbishop of Cape Coast. Most Reverend Charles Gabriel Palmer Buckle took to social media to announce that he had received treatments for COVID-19. This is just a video shot from the recovery garden at the Ga East Infectious Disease Center where I am undergoing treatment for COVID-19. He is not the only person to do that. The Director of Business Operations at Dalex Finance and Leasing Company, Joe Jackson, on February 6, 2021, also took to Twitter to announce that he had tested positive for the virus. The symptoms suffered by COVID-19 patients, however, differ from person to person. Some of the symptoms include fatigue, dry cough, fever, loss of taste and smell, severe headache, cold, and shortness of breath. The Chief Executive Officer of CTFM and City TV, Samuel Atamensa, also made public his ordeal with the virus. The headaches come at night. Hey. Hey. So you haven't slept properly in like a month? No, it, they, they come at night and then I have the headache, intense headache. Head pounding. No, Bernard, headache that I've never experienced in my life before. And it's like a certain part of your head to your forehead. Heavy. Wow. I mean, the kind of headache that you can't even turn mm. your head unless you turn your entire body. That's the kind of headache I'm talking about. And it was so prompt at 8 p.m. throughout <laughs> the night. It was so bad, you cannot even bat your eye. You can't sleep. For the Director of Business Operations at Dalex Finance and Leasing Company, Joe Jackson, battling the disease wasn't enough as his weight became a barrier to getting some tests done. Other prominent persons who have survived the virus include the Health Minister-designate, Kweku Ajimang Menu, the CEO of the National Health Insurance Authority, Dr. Lydia Jan Selby, and Finance Minister-designate, Ken Uforiata. Health professionals and scientists across the globe have warned about the gravity of the second variant. Survivors of COVID-19 have, through their communication with the public, relayed the singular message of adhering to the safety precautions. My advice is what I call the three Ps. Prayer, protocols, and prayer. And you can add two more to it. And protocols and prayer, so it becomes five. Just do all the protocols.
Now, doing all the protocols is not to say that you can never get it. It is to say that you lessen the probability of being exposed. Now, take kind of way, sorry. You will say, the president take COVID America social distancing, hygienic protocol, in your friend, your group. In your friend, your group. Family. So, we are here. You are here, the president has to go to the group. Prince Charles, you let me know. The idea the British Prime Minister got to ICU. That's all they announced to you. We are giants. 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 We are giants.